So what can an NFL linebacker teach you about weight loss? Stay tuned to find out. Today, I'm here with NFL linebacker Tevon Coney. Tevon also played linebacker at Notre Dame, which is a school I also graduated from. So we are both alumni, go Irish. Tevon also has a foundation called Tough Choices that helps local youth by providing them with the essential tools to be successful in and outside of school. So Tevon, <laughs> you've never been fat before, correct? <laughs> no, so my uh, coach, he was like, man, you gotta put, you gotta put some weight on. Right. Um, you know, you gotta get bigger to, you know, play linebacker now. And this yeah. time by like 175, 180, like I said, and I'm like, yeah, man, like, I don't know how I'm gonna do this. <laughs> so my first instinct, and at this time I didn't work out much. I wasn't yeah. it was more just natural and genetics. Um, right, right. And so I, I got to start getting into the weight room, start lifting a lot of weight. I was mm -hmm. running a lot. And out of nowhere, like it took me about six months. I just like got huge out of nowhere. I jumped up to about <laughs> 215. But the most wow. weirdest thing ever that uh, a lot of my trainers had said was that, man, a lot of people that make that type of like weight gain, it goes yeah. from about 175 to 220 in that short span of time, you yeah. gain a lot of fat. Because for most of your life, you have a body that most men would love to have and most women would love their guy to have. <laughs> so I, I, feel, I feel as if I'm using that line from James Bond where they're like, most men want to be him and most women want to be with him. <laughs> kind of thing. But I guess what's a typical workout type routine for somebody like yourself? I'll get up in the morning. Obviously, the important thing that uh, trainers and uh, nutrition always tell you, everyone who's watching and, you know, people who want to, get weight gain or, mm -hmm. or you know, weight loss. Yeah. The biggest thing is that it's so unique to just them. And so you take yes. the concept of what people have done and you tailor it to what works best for me and what my goals are. Mm -hmm. And then I'll get into, you know, some individual um, exercises like shoulder presses, shoulder raises, you know, okay. different things like that to right. you know, build that muscle to make mm -hmm. those bigger muscles around my shoulders, particularly right. for my position. Exactly. Tackling, you gotta have you know strong shoulders. Strong so doing yeah. little stability workouts like that um, was huge for me. So what's your diet like? Like for uh, example, do you track calories? Do you do you have to track macronutrients, or you just need to eat a ton of food? <laughs> I'm all about just burning more than I'm than, I, than I'm eating if I want to yeah. lose weight. Right. And then if I want to gain weight, it's just making sure that I eat more than I burn. Mm -hmm. while knowing that I'm doing the exercise I need to, you know, stay down and kind right. of gain the proper weight. So, Got it. Um, you know, that's kind of a simple way for me is just making sure I'm burning more than I eat. I want to mm -hmm. lose weight. Um, and if I want to gain weight, making sure that I uh, eat more than I burn. And, you gotcha. know, that's something for me that has just worked and I've just kept that philosophy for me personally. So what supplements do you personally use and what would you recommend that people, what it is, them trying to maintain their weight, lose weight, or as a bonus, help them put on muscle mass. <laughs> Man, this might be a bummer, but yes. <laughs> um, I've never been into supplements. Um, okay. I am I am a fan of them for people, like I say, because yeah. I love workouts. I love mm -hmm. how working out is so tailored to anybody and everybody yeah, yeah, who wants yeah. to embrace the role of that journey of, you know, mm -hmm. bettering their, their uh, self. So, um, but I, I would say, you know, going to GNC, uh, they have a lot of products, obviously, on Amazon. Um, right. <laughs> I I took Rebuild Mass a lot um, in high school and college. That was big okay. for me to gain a lot of weight. So if I wanted to gain a lot of weight, I had milk and went to powder and was mm -hmm. chugging two to three a day. And basically <laughs> had it as like a meal replacement sometimes. Right. I couldn't eat. Yeah. Plus, counted one as a snack. So I was allowed okay. to technically take at least two if I replace the meal mm. and then consider it one of the shakes as a snack because taking a product but not working out as consistent won't give you yes. results. Taking yep. a product, working out, but not getting sleep won't give you the results. So, <laughs> you know, as we talk through each different aspect, they yeah. all are just important. And yep. you making sure that you find a uh, yeah. <laughs> supplement that goes with what you're doing, you know? So I think just overall, just I know some people that like work out in the morning, you mm -hmm. know, so getting in these joints with a lot of caffeine. You're right, you right. Get going in the morning, you have to burn more uh, calories, burn more yep. fat. So that's a cheat cheat is that someone work out in the morning, mm -hmm. they take some caffeine in there, get a, get, the, get their energy going, then they get, right. get more active in the gym, mm -hmm. which will turn into, you know, more uh, calories being burnt. Right, right, right. In the right. morning.